Hey guys, welcome to the video today. In today's video, we are going to take a look at the pivot light on my Dremel 4300. And from what I can tell, the pivot light is not sold separately. They only uh, give it to you when you purchase the Dremel 4300. And maybe Dremel will make it available in the future for the other Dremel rotary tools. But as far as I can tell right now, it just comes with the Dremel 4300 when you purchase it. Um, so let's take a closer look at the pivot light, but before we do, uh, make sure that you've read through your operating and safety instructions before you ever use your Dremel tool. Uh, it will tell you everything you need to know on how to use the Dremel tool both safely and properly. Also make sure that you're always wearing proper safety equipment. Okay, let's go ahead and get a closer look at the Dremel pivot light. All right, guys, so I have my Dremel tool both off and unplugged, and I'm going to take off the keyless chuck here. And then we can take off the easy twist cap with the pivot light. And it just, um, the pivot light uh, sits in, like, this part of the easy twist cap. It's recessed there. All right, guys, here is the pivot light all detached from everything, and there's what it looks like while it's on. Um, we'll take it over to like a project area um, just to test out how well it works. Okay, so here's all the stuff Dremel says about it, and in this part here they say, the light module included with your tool is intended to provide you with improved visibility while working on your project. It uses two replaceable CR1025 batteries included to power the LED and can be rotated around the front of the tool depending on your needs. So um, let's go ahead and put this back on the tool here. So... Let's put this on here first, and then we'll take it over to um, like a project that, you know, maybe somebody could find themselves working on um, and just see how well it illuminates the project area. So yeah, like in this case, you know, it twisted around further than I would want it. So I'm going to move it back here a little bit. So when we uh, twist up the easy twist uh, cap here should line up. I want it to line up with uh, the lock button and the on and off button, but you can rotate it all the way around wherever you want it to be. So, um, okay, um, let me put the uh, keyless chuck back on here and let's go test this out. All right, guys, here is like one of the corners uh, underneath the control panel of uh, one of my arcade games. This is Smash TV, but you know, uh, maybe, you know, just to demonstrate how this works, you know, you might be in a corner like this and it's, you know, not the greatest visibility. So let's see how well this light does at lighting up that area. And yeah, I mean, you can see it helps, definitely helps improve the visibility of that area. Um, so while I would be working in it, I could see a little bit better what I was doing. So, um, you know, here's with it on. And then here's with nothing. You know, so it definitely adds, you know, just that little bit extra visibility uh, helping me uh, to see what I would be working on. Okay, let's head back to the workbench. All right, guys, well, there it was, the Dremel pivot light. And, you know, it's not like super powerful, but it is cool. Um, you know, it definitely helps give improved visibility on the project that you would be working on. So I think it's a nice addition to the Dremel 4300. And it's kind of a bummer that you can't, um, you know, purchase it separately for the other Dremel rotary tools. So hopefully in the future, that's, uh, you know, something they make available for the other Dremel rotary tools. But as far as I could tell right now, it, it only comes with purchase on the Dremel 4300. So um, I hope you guys like this video and thank you so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. Have a good one. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment. And if you have the time, check out these other great videos.